I strongly encourage um, you all to stand up, use your voices, share your messages, and encourage the youth and empower the youth to speak up and use their voices as well. I'm very thankful for this award and I'm very honored. This is amazing and I'm so thankful that I'm being recognized for my, um, for my work and that I've come so far. So thank you so much for recognizing me my work. My name is Autumn Pelche. Um, I'm the Chief Water Commissioner for Anishinaabek Nation. I'm 16 years old. I'm doing this work as we can't just pray anymore. We must do something and we need to do it now. Water is a basic human right. Everyone deserves access to clean drinking water no matter what our race or color is or how rich or poor we are. When I was eight years old, I was um, attending a water ceremony in a First Nations community. I asked my mom to go to the washroom and all over the walls said, don't drink the water, not for consumption, boil water advisory. And we had to use hand sanitizer after using the washroom. And I was very confused as to why it was like that. So I asked my mom, what does all of this mean? Why can't we drink the water? Why can't we wash our hands? And then she explained to me what all of it meant, what a boil water, what water advisory was, and that the community that we were in has been on a boil water advisory for over 20 years. It should not be like this. That's when you know something is wrong, is when a child speaks up. And that's when you have to do something to fix it, because we shouldn't have to be speaking up.